This is one of my favorite spots at Foguangshan Monastery. My name is Reed Criddle, and I am a 2017-2018 Fulbright Taiwan um, Senior Scholar. I am um, doing research, and my host institution is the Institute for Humanistic Buddhism here at Foguangshan Monastery. Uh, I am by trade a musician, uh, an educator, and a conductor. I conduct choirs primarily and teach, uh, teach singing. My project was to research Buddhist chant here in the Pure Land uh, Mahayana tradition, um, to notate it for choirs around the world to, to sing, and then also to let what I learn about Buddhist chant influence my own compositions and arrangements. There have been two main thrusts to my uh, research and, and the outcomes of what I've done. The first is to, I've been transcribing chants, writing them down into five-line staff notation so that people can experience the details of the music without being here in Taiwan. And the product of that has been a book that I just finished writing on the Medicine Buddha Sutra and its service that takes place during the liberation of, of water and land ceremony. Uh, which here at Foguangshan is in November. Second, I, as a composer, I've taken the chants that I've learned and the general inspiration of, of the, the chants, the sentiment, and I've made my own compositions. And from these that are loosely inspired by the things I've learned and the philosophies that I've experienced here in the monastery, uh, I've created a variety of compositions that, that speak to my experience, um, both religious uh, texts and also some poetry that I've written myself that is more autobiographical. I'm struck by that conversation because one of the reasons I came to Taiwan to do this research was to um, bring the Buddhist chanting back to the United States so that I could teach my students, teach choral students across the country how to sing, how to perform Buddhist music. And yet, I have struggled here in Taiwan to negotiate the difference between performance and, and chant as a meditation. And from my conversations with the Venerable and, and other uh, monastics in Taiwan, I have become more sensitive to the fact that, that chanting is not so much about um, a performance or an artistic product, but that it's, or even necessarily devotion to a greater being, say the Buddha. Um, but it is the act of chant, of chanting, is really a meditation. My hope for this research is that I come away with a greater cultural sensitivity for Buddhist chanting, for its context, for its intended audiences, and the mindset with which one should approach singing um, music from Buddhist traditions. And then secondarily, I hope to um, increase the choral curriculum around the world to include um, Buddhist music 
that choirs um, and choral educators globally can uh, use Buddhist music in addition to largely a, a Christian tradition of choral music to um, expose their students to religions of, around the world.